just want to welcome everybody to the launch of Take Back the Tap here in Portland. Take Back the Tap is uh, part of a national campaign to expose some of the myths and dangers of the bottled water industry, uh, to encourage a reinvestment in our public water systems, uh, and to celebrate and protect our local watersheds. So bottled water co uh, production alone uh, uses up over 17 million barrels of oil every single year. Uh, that's enough to take one million cars off the road. Um, that creates also two million tons of plastic waste. Uh, so the environmental costs and the health costs of choosing bottled water are, are huge. We think water should be safe and clean and affordable for everybody. I am uh, Councillor Dave Marshall and um, on uh, Monday I brought forward a resolution to the Portland City Council. It's called the Resolution to Protect America's Water, Creating a Trust Fund to Keep Our Water Clean and Safe. Uh, this, uh, this, order was, uh, this resolution was co-sponsored by, co by Councillor Jill Dusen. And I'm uh, happy to say today that it passed on an eight to one vote. Uh, this, uh, what this resolution does is it asks the federal government to create a, a public, water, uh, public water infrastructure trust fund so that way we have funds available to invest in our, in our public water infrastructure. In the city of Portland, we're blessed with a great drinking water supply, but at the same time we have an aging water infrastructure that's going to cost us millions of dollars to, to, to maintain over a period of time. I'd like to thank the uh, local restaurants uh, that have come forward and have uh, pledged not to purchase and sell bottled water and to instead uh, enjoy the clean, safe municipal water that we have here in the city of Portland. Um, I think today is a really proud day to be uh, living in the city of Portland and seeing uh, the city of Portland be a leader in this country uh, in terms of people's public health and safety and also concerning resources that uh, are um, very much in demand and are at the core uh, source of a lot of the violence that we see around the world. Um, it's been incredible to walk through the streets of Portland and talk to the business owners uh, such as folks at uh, the North Star Cafe and Local 188 who have pledged to eliminate the sale of bottled water. This is not an easy time for businesses, especially restaurants in the city of Portland, um, and their willingness and, and courage, I'd say, to um, take this pledge for um, their customers' health should be applauded and recognized. And I think that's one of the reasons we chose the farmer's market as a location today, because of our um, sincere belief that the people of Portland are very concerned with not just buying locally, consuming locally, but consuming health, healthily. Water is a global issue. And this is the kind of thing that we'd like to see um, not just uh, activists and folks at Peace Action Maine be using as an alternative, but to really encourage there are really sustainable, simple steps we can take as individuals in this city. Um, we think Portland has some of the safest, best tap water in the world, and so we're encouraging everyone <clears throat> to choose tap water over the bottled brands whenever possible. Um, but beyond that, to support policies that protect and celebrate your local watershed, protect a reinvestment in public infrastructure, um, and uh, reaffirm that water is something that should be safe and clean and affordable for everybody.